everyone, Silver Hyena back again in the kitchen and it is way too hot to bother with any makeup so I don't care that you see my face as it actually is. Anyways, we made waffles yesterday and now we need to use up the leftovers. Jeez, it is hot in here right now and the oven hasn't even gone on yet. I apologize for the really bad lighting, but it is typical bipolar Washington weather. It cannot make up its mind what it wants to do. It is bright cloudy, bright cloudy, bright cloudy. So it's not your monitor. It's this Washington state weather. Please bear with me. Anyways, we have some leftover Belgian waffles. If you haven't seen that video yet, I will post a link in the description below so that you can take a look at that. Now go watch that video if you haven't already. Have you watched it? Good. We're going to do something a little different today because we have hollandaise and we have Canadian bacon. So we are going to make a waffles benedict. Oh yeah, and of course we've got the eggs as well. Can't have a Benedict without the eggs. Anyways, let's get started. First things first, we've got to get our waffles prepped and ready. So we are using our leftover waffles instead of the standard English muffin. So we're just going to, oh boy, hopefully I can get all the pieces to fit on here. Everybody wants to eat tonight, so... Anyways, this was actually an ingenious idea that my mom and I came up with when we were discussing some ideas of what to do with the leftover waffles. Yeah, that'll be fine. So I'm just gonna put this in the toaster and I'll get right back with you. All right, so we've got our pan here for poaching our eggs. Saucepan right here for doing our hollandaise. I apologize for the horrible vantage point, but where I usually put my camera to get a good shot, the sun is coming in at just the right angle to totally destroy everything. So you'll, you'll have to bear with me, I apologize. It, it, the, the sun, it, it's horrible, believe me. So what you'll want to do is read the directions on the back of your hollandaise sauce packet. Or if you're making your own from scratch, you can do that. Me, there's only so much extra cooking I'm going to do. Okay, I decided to switch to voiceover here because, well, everything just seemed to be going wrong. A lot of the behind the scenes stuff, it was not going well. You might not be able to see it here, but pretty much anything that could mess up was messing up. Also, I was saying some very naughty, no-no adult words. And the sun. Just where the sun was. I don't want to speak of it anymore. It just... Mm. It's seriously amazing how the sun in just the wrong place can mess up your shots. So I wasn't able to place my camera where I usually like to place it. I was running out of room on the counters. It was... As stated before, it was just a mess. Luckily, thanks to some help from my mom and dad, it wasn't a complete disaster. But since everything finishes all at once, it seems, yeah, I began to stress out a little. Okay, let's stop fooling ourselves. Let's stop fooling myself, anyway. I was stressing out a lot. On top of everything else, it's summer, it's hot, I'm sticky, sweaty, and uncomfortable, and there is no breeze. 
So I was getting kind of miserable and I think it shows on film. That being said, I'm still happy to have tried this. It was my first time poaching eggs, so there is that. I guess what can be taken from this, you can't succeed if you don't try in the first place. Even when things don't seem to be going well. The eggs, while they might not look pretty, came out really well. See? I even surprised myself. Just make sure that when you try this, have some helping hands with you. Hopefully you won't be wrangling a tripod and camera either. <laughs> Alright, that's all I've got to say about this. We made it. We survived. Now, it is time to indulge in the fruits of my labor. Alright, let's try this. Mm. This is such an unusual way to eat a waffle, but it's good. Post in the comments if you've tried this or want to try it. Or we'll bribe your parents to make it for you and try it. <laughs> Anyways, that's all the time we have for today. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this video. And subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. For videos like this and other disasters. Anyways, this is Silver Hyena signing off. And I'm going to get off the kitchen floor now. Bye!